So SB4, which obviously is in the court system now, uh, the, the law, and help me if I'm wrong here, but I don't think so, but the, the law basically says that you can go ahead, Texas law enforcement can arrest an illegal immigrant, but in essence, you put him back to the port of entry or in essence, turn him over to the feds. I mean, that becomes potentially catch and release again, because whatever the feds do with them, they do with them. I mean, I know judges have a role in all of this. So, so what about some sort of, people have suggested, some sort of green zone in Mexico? In other words, T have Texas actually take the illegals and put them across the border rather than handing them back over to the feds. Right. To, to be clear, it does not end up in catch and release uh, because what it does, if, if uh, they come back to the state of Texas, uh, they're subject to being arrested again and put behind bars for 20 years. Mm -hmm. uh, and so there's every incentive in the world for them not to come back. Otherwise, uh, we will arrest them and they'll spend decades uh, behind bars. But let's be clear about what we're doing. Uh, in SB4 because uh, what, what Texas is doing, uh, we are authorizing every law enforcement officer in the state of Texas to do the federal government's job. Mm -hmm. Congress already passed laws that exist on the books today mm -hmm. that require the federal government to deny illegal entry, mm -hmm. to detain anybody who comes here illegally, uh, and uh, to uh, deport people who come here who are, are captured.